must be mixed feelings for you, Marley, back in the starting lineup, but a defeat against Gillingham. Yeah, I'm happy to be back in the starting lineup, but obviously not happy with the defeat. Just think we've got to keep going and keep working, and the wins will come. Yeah, and not just today, but over the course of the last few weeks, it's just those fine margins in each penalty area that didn't go away again. That's exactly what's happened this season with us. We've been good other than both boxes, I think, and we could be more clinical and stop goals a bit more. So, yeah. yeah and, and did you notice from the sidelines, it looked like the first half was a bit cagey with both sides, but the second half was very, very open. Do you notice that kind of thing out on the pitch? Yeah, yeah, 100%. The first half was, I think both teams are a bit just feeling the game, but second half, I think both went out there and both tried to win the game. And I think... Yeah, if we were a bit more clinical and we stopped that, it was a crap goal to give away. Could have come out with a point or three. Yeah, and for you personally, you know, you, you must feel at times that it suited your game, Gillingham wanting to play in areas that you could kind of stop them playing and, and feel that it was something that benefited you. Yeah, 100%. I know how to read the game. So I know when to push, it, push in, make a tackle, or if needed, or just sit in front with a striker keep that pressure so we could keep attacking and yeah so I did that today yeah and you must feel you got through the, the game or the minutes that you needed to get through how hard has it been to to keep that focus and make sure that you are ready for when the head coach asks you to do the job um I think it's been hard but I think I've got through it well I think I've matured in that sense where I wasn't throwing my toys out of the pram and I was just kept working and working until I got my chance. Yeah, and I, I suppose it is that case of being mentally strong to knowing that the right thing to do if you're not in the team is to do the right thing because mm. otherwise you're not going to be ready. Yeah, that's what I praise myself and I think I am very men mentally strong and I've become that over the years. So, yeah. And I suppose it's a case now of looking at all those areas that you were good at, not just today, but in the last few weeks, and just making them longer in games and doing more of it. And of course, being clinical in both boxes. Yeah, 100%. We just got to keep sticking to what what we're doing and just keep grinding out. And we'll, we need to start grinding out results when it's a point and then we'll become free. Um, yeah, we'll keep, we'll keep going at it. And, and for you, it's a case of hoping that performance keeps you in the head coach's eyes and, and you can perform uh, even more. Yeah, 100%. I want to do what's best for the team and that's what I'll do every chance I get.